Well, hello again. This is John here. Figured I'd do a update on the uh, the generator cover slash. <laughs> it's going to be a solar. Um, I'm going to put on this this uh, slope here. I'm going to put. Uh, I've got. I bought uh, four hundred watt Renogy uh, solar panels, and you notice I I added. Uh, casters the swivel on the front and just straight on the back um, I figure uh, I'm gonna I haven't figured out which one I'm gonna get I think I'm leaning towards the uh, the blue eddy uh, I think it's the 200 max it's got the 30 amp um, RV plug um, and then when I when I'm running the generator, I can charge it from the generator. But then I can also, when the sun's out, I can wheel wheel it out. Um, I'll probably put the solar panels. Yeah, it doesn't matter because I could face it wherever the sun is out in the driveway. Um, but I, I'll be able to charge that. Um, Blue Eddy 200 Max. Uh, either way, with the with the with the Kubota diesel um, 7 kW generator while I'm running it during the day, and then the thought is is then I don't have to run the generator all night. I can just plug. Uh, if you remember right, I, my plug is right up there that goes down to my transfer switch. And I can run, I'm not going to run the well, I would just run my two refrigerators um, and freezer and boiler pumps and um, obviously the boiler. Um, and that, that way, in, if it powers off in the winter time at night, the, the boiler would run uh, all night with that. I'm pretty sure it, it should be capable. I got to do a little more checking with the electrician to see if it, it should be um, capable. I know you can add more battery amp hours, but I just want to make sure the uh, the initial size of the unit, the amp, amp, amp whatever you call it, the amp, amp P um, charge controller thing is, is, is the right for that amount of, I got to do a little math and figuring, but that's the plan. Um, but you can see I added these casters, and it I just should have probably got the locking ones. Um, I don't think the wind. I've got I've just got some blocks of wood there right now. I don't think the wind will blow that around. But um, and I'm also probably I I don't know. I haven't decided yet if I'm going to add any steel to the sides of it it's nice and lightweight I can move it around um, as it is but anyhow that's the uh, the latest on the uh, the generator um, I call it catch them power and light <laughs> backup system <laughs> so all right just a little update you guys have a good day what a beautiful day here in northern Illinois River Valley is, you can see the other side. Well, I'll walk out there and show you off the deck here. I gotta redo this deck this summer. The 30 year old redwood is kinda gotten, it's, it's weathered looking. <laughs> but there's the River Valley. Um, the sunroom, timber frame sunroom. But uh, you can see the other side of the river valley now. It's uh, pretty much all the leaves are down. All right, you guys have a good one. God bless.